Hi guys. So today is going to be and um, doing an updated car tour and car video. I did the first one of these when I got my peas when I got the car. And I've had this car for a little bit over a year now, so now I just kind of want to show you what's new, what's updated, if there is anything updated, or what's new in the car, and what's stayed the same and everything, so, yeah, that's gonna be that, still have the same car and everything, so, yeah, give this video a like, subscribe to my channel if you want, you don't have to, and let's get on with the video. So first is the outside, and so now I'm on the outside, this is still the front, just gonna cover up that license plate, but now I have a green P instead of a red P now, same, same, just a little bit dirty on the sides of the car here, so this is the, this is the driver's side. The fuel cap and the back again. Can cover up the license plate, the EX one, and the P on the back. Kia and the Sorento badge. There we go. And then the passenger side with the wings. Like I said, they're from the previous owner before I had it and like I said it's a bit dirty on the bottom and everywhere else <laughs> it gets dirty once I go to my boyfriend's house and coming back around with the nudge bar so these are my keys with the lock unlock boot the boot button doesn't really work my key and little stuff at my super barn little stuff for, to put in the trolley so now I'm just gonna lock and unlock my car so I can get the boot opened and show you the boot so in this boot I have this little bag I've got my Australia Day hat in here my sunshade umbrella, oil filters that I never, that I didn't need to use, some sun, this big bottle of sunscreen. I have some bags in here. I have my super barn ones. I have a one in here with stuff to go in the bin, which I'll actually put this in as well. And I just have an empty can of. And an empty can of energy drink mother that I'll put away in the bin. Then I have some coolant here. I have this little vacuum flashlight in case my car breaks down at night and I need some light and my phone's dead. And a picnic blanket in here. And I have this little, I have this key finder thing that was on my keys. And it broke off, so I just keep it in there. And that's my boot. I'm gonna go put this in the bin, and that's my boot. Now coming into the back seat, I have my dirty footy boots. Just there have the netball kit bag in here and that's pretty much it except I have a smaller version of the big um, vacuum in there and nothing in these the pocket seat the pockets at the back now getting into the driver's seat and I'm gonna sit in the car show you around so all the buttons and bits and bobs are all the same you've got my boot opener here the button to open the fuel cap here 
the little latch to pull the hatch open here the pedals big one is big one the big one is the accelerator small one is the brake then i've got light i think i'm not sure then the thing to turn to a four by four then little knobby things works this one kind of doesn't the one in the middle kind of doesn't work as well as the lights windows and the charm lock. Down here I have a microfiber towel and some masks. Steering wheel. That's locked at the moment because the cars are not on. And then you have cruise control settings here. And then you have lights and the blinker on this side where you put the key in. The little, uh, I was about to say, there we go dashboard with RPMs there, speedometer, my odometer here. I will turn it on because it's a bit dark to show you. And then when you're in park, reverse neutral drive, temperature and the fuel cap near. So that's when everything lights up. And this is like just an accessory mode and my stereo comes up and then these are all the fans. This is my car mount. I got a new one because the one that I previously had just it kept like my phone kept falling off and I found this car mount that does it magnetic so the little magnetic bit is on the back of my phone and it just sticks like that. So yeah, my stereo, that's Bluetooth, this is the rear view, like the back mirror, like the back, demister, warning lights, fog lights, and then I can change the hour, like the time here, all the same, same, driver, passenger, you can do it dual or you can change it different size AC this is the front window demister to make the fan go up and down and this is where the air is coming from so this is from coming from the outside or you want it to kind of go around the whole car then and this one I just have a spare license and a pen in here And this has a little cigarette light in here and I could probably put something in there but I don't. I have my phone case, my car charger, then we've got this gear shift which I have a couple of scrunchies on, I just keep them there. Handbrake, so you push it down and push it down. I have some shells in here that I've kept something in there. I kind of have a bit of chocolate around. It's stuck. Sand in there too. Then I have this little gold push little portable bin. Here's my can from earlier. Then just on the passenger side I have these like cords that I'm not going to use. And this eyeshadow palette that I am going to put back in the house because I don't need it. Over there I have some magnetic green pea plates in case the ones at the front get a bit faded then I will put the magnetic ones on my glove box just has like my documents I have um, a spare little sunblock a smaller eyeshadow palette and some perfume things in there Now getting into my center console in this first little bit, I have the old car mount. I still haven't opened this from last time. It's just like a little perfume key, a key chain that I can put, but I haven't picked that yet. The little bit to stick it to the car mount to the 
dashboard and I still have these two globby things. I tried to use them. I used one but it just didn't really work as well so I just keep them in there but they don't work. Then in here I've added some stuff. So gun, same. The wipes, same. I might actually wipe. I might actually grab some actual car ones because I just have these ones. These biodegradable ones, but they're not really for cars. Well, they're not not for cars, but yeah. Then I have some CDs in here that I've started to collect and buy and stuff. So I have that in there too now, and that's new. But yeah. And that's everything inside the car. I have my Sorrento mats as well. But then come through the mirror, the vanity, and it illuminates. Then in this little bit, I have sunglasses holder with some things in there. And light. Then this mode, so I have the range to when I need to fill up, and I can change that to different modes. The direction that I'm currently facing, and yeah. Then here I can do the sunroof. So do that button, and then it opens it up. And that to close it. So just this one to close it, this one to open it. And you can, I'll close it up. And then you can tilt it so then only a little bit of air comes in and not the whole thing. And it's very dirty at the moment. But yeah, and then that button to close it down. And then. That you can do manually or you, when I did it, it does it together. But it doesn't come back together so then you have to close it yourself. But that's, that's my car tour. And that is everything. Thanks so much for watching this updated car tour video. I'm going to turn it off now. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you want to see more videos with me and my car, comment them down below. Like this video, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the bell for notifications. And yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.